about the place value? How about the value of a digit and the three-digit number? Okay, nice! That if you still remember that place value. Before we start our lesson for today, we have a game wherein I have here a riddle. The guest and check wherein you will be able to answer it as fast as you can. Did you understand class? Is it clear? Okay, without further ado, let's start. I am three digit number. My hundreds digit is nine, my tens digit is eight, and my ones digit is five. What number am I? Class, you will answer it as fast as you can in a one, two, three, go! Okay, you got the correct answer which is the 985 or the 985. Very good, class! That riddle class has something to do with our lesson for today because our lesson for today is Visualize and write three-digit numbers in expanded form. So, let's start our lesson. Let's talk about first class. What is expanded form? Or when do we say that the numbers are in expanded form? When we say expanded form class, always remember that it is the digit of the number are split into each of the individual digits with their place value. For you to understand the place value class, I have here the place value chart. I will give you an example class, the three digit number, and we will going to write it in expanded form. For example, is the three 4 and 2 or the 342. As you can see here in our table class, we have the table of 1s, 10s, and 100s. For our example 342, the 1s place here is the 2, right? And the 10s place here is the 4. And the 100s place here is the 3. Therefore, class, we read it as three hundreds, four tens, and two ones. Always put into your mind, class, that when we are writing the three-digit numbers in expanded form, all we need to do is to add two zero in the hundreds place, okay? And when the tens place, we only have add one zero. And for the ones place class, we don't need to add zero because we can only write the number itself, okay? Did you understand? Okay. For now on class, we illustrate it on how 342 be expressed and we use the addition in writing the expanded form. Now class, we simply write the 342 in expanded form like this. 300 plus 40 plus 2 is now the expanded form of 342. Did you get it class? Now, I will give another example of 3-digit number 
and we will write it in the expanded form. 4 example is the 418 or 418. So first thing to do class is we write it in the table. Ones, tens, and hundreds. For our ones place, we will write eight. And for the tens place class, we will write one. And for the hundreds place, we will write four. And how this three digit number, we will write it in expanded form. All we need to do class, as what I've said a while ago, in the hundreds place, we add two. 0 and for the tens place we only have add 1 0 and for the ones place class we only write it by itself because we don't need to write or add a 0 for the ones place did you get it class therefore class we write it in expanded form like this 4 hundreds we add 2 0 and 1 stands, we add 1 0 and 8 for the 1s, we don't need to add 0. So, 418 in expanded form is 400 plus 10 plus 8. So, that will be the expanded form of 418 or 418. Here also the another example of three digit numbers in expanded form. So the number 689 or 689. So all we need to do class is we draw a table wherein this will be have the ones, tens, and hundreds. For the ones we have nine. For the tens we have eight. And for the hundreds we have 6. So now, what we gonna do now to write it in expanded form? So remember, we add 2 zero in hundreds, 1 zero for tens, and the number itself for the ones, okay? So therefore class, we write 689 in expanded form like this. 600 plus 80 plus 9. So, that will be the expanded form of 689. Now, did you understand it, class? Okay, very good. Now, I think, class, that you are ready to answer your activity. So, this activity will be groupings, okay? I will be divide the class into two. The group one and the group two. So, here is the instruction class. I will be the one who say the three-digit number and all you need to do is each member of your group will in front and then they will answer what I have said, three-digit number to write what is it expanded form, okay? And the one who got the correct and first got the high score will be considered as the winner. So, are you ready, class? Okay, let's start. First, write the expanded form of 967. Ready? Get set. Go! Next is, write the expanded form of 482. Next, write the expanded form of 117 Next one How can we write the expanded form of 565? Next is How about How can we write the expanded form of 987? Class, it's really nice to see you All of you are enjoying Answering the group activity or our game so congratulations to all of you the group that considered as the winner is the group one because they are got the high 
score. Now, I think that all of you are ready to answer your activity. Bring your paper and pen and answer the following question individually. your assignment. So, that's all for the day. Thank you so much, class, for your active participation. So, see you next meeting!